Beer bomb! Henry, are you feeling all right? Fine, thank you, Mum. Just wanted to get into school early. You sure you're feeling all right, Henry? Bye, Mum! Bet you're wondering if I'm feeling all right too. Well, the answer's yes. Today is the last day of term, which means no more school for weeks and weeks and weeks. It's holiday time! Glad we're not going to have to watch that for a while. Yeah, cos it's... Holiday time! Come on, you horrible lot. Get a move on. Thank you, kind sir. What did you say? Uh, well, I said thank you, kind sir. Right. That's it, you horrid boy. <laughs> Detention! Now, now, Mr Soggington, let's not get too enthusiastic. It's the last day of term, remember? Oh, yes, Miss Oddmonna. I was, um, forgetting myself. Oh, run along, Henry. We'll defer your detention to next term, if anybody remembers it. Yes, Miss Ogbord. I don't know about you, but I've got the feeling that today's going to be a good day. <laughs> I think we could do better than that. It is a special day today, after all. They won't keep till next term, whatever you say. <laughs> Thank you, Graves, Mum. You're welcome, Henry. Going somewhere nice for your holidays? Oh, yeah. Well, my mum hasn't actually booked anything yet, but that's nice, dear. Best day ever! <laughs> this battle axe was positively cheerful in lessons this morning. <laughs> for their holidays. I don't know. Somewhere with no spiders. Or any other creepy crawlies. Sports camp. Executive chef course. 50 winning ways with a carrot. As far away from here as possible. Yeah, me too. At least I hope it will be. I'm thinking desert island, sun, sea, sand. Uh-oh. Bogey brains not allowed. Happy holidays. Nothing can spoil today, cos it's... Holiday time! Oops, won't be needing that for a while. Guess what, Henry? It's holiday time! And? And we're going to a desert island? Nope. Mum says it's much more exciting than a desert island. <laughs> Let's go find out! Oh! We're going on holiday next door. Well, just that, really. Margaret's mum mentioned that they were going away. Yeah, to a desert island, most likely. Don't be horrid, Henry. How is that horrid? Going on holiday to a desert island is about the most unhorrid thing I can think of. You know what mum meant. So when she said they were looking for someone to house sit... We volunteered to do it. That's horrid. Well, I think it sounds like fun. Do you, honey bun? Yes! We can pack up our suitcases and we can lock up the front door and check all the windows at least three times and then we can walk down the garden path and then we can come back again to check all the windows are locked and then... Yes, all right, Peter, we get the message. The best thing is Fluffy Wuffy can come with us! Meow. And we won't have to send her to the Comfy Cat Spa. So, it's all sorted then. We're off on holiday tomorrow. Yippee! Yay. Don't, Don't be, be horrid, horrid, Henry. All packed, Henry. I guess so. Good, because we're leaving nice and early to avoid the traffic. We're only going next door. We can leave any time we like. Oh, don't be horrid, Henry. As you can see, I packed for every occasion. Not. At least there's one good thing about going on holiday next door. You can always come back if you've forgotten something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can come with us, Fang! Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Because if smelly cat's coming, then you are too. Oh well, tomorrow's another day, as they say. Will you all hurry up? We're going to be late. All the more reason to get going. Henry! Let me help you with that. Ooh. I see you haven't packed all your belongings. No. Come on then, let's get loading. What should we do first? How about I make us a nice cup of tea while you start unpacking? What a good idea. Yay. Right, Peter, you're in the guest suite. Yippee! Come on, number no, number 22. Let's go and look at our bedroom. Henry, you're in Margaret's bedroom. What? Why do I have to sleep in Bogey Brain's bedroom? Because, Henry. Why can't the worms sleep there? He even likes pink. Sorry, Henry. It specifically says here that you want to sleep in Margaret's bedroom. So? It's not like it's some sort of contract, is it? Actually, yes, Henry. It is a contract. What? Yes, Henry. It's always a good idea to have a contract for this sort of thing, just in case anything goes wrong. But, but what else is in the contract? <clears throat> no feet on the sofa, living room carpet or walls. No takeaways. Not even pizza? Nope. What's a holiday without pizza? No wild parties, no DIY, no cooking on an open fire, no painting with fingers, brushes or any form of distribution mechanism, no making of films, no tapestry making or willow basket weaving, no crumbs, no animals unless they're called fluffy, and especially no animals if they look like a rat. Fang! Where's Fang? We had to leave him at home. No rat-like animals, Henry. Fang isn't a rat! I know, but he does look like one sometimes. Well, in a certain light. No moles, no snoots, no... Where are you going, Henry? To feed Fang. He'll starve without me there. Or had you forgotten that he needs feeding? It's all right, Henry. We've made sure you won't starve. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm going back anyway. I'm fed up of this holiday lark. We're not going home, Henry. At least not for two weeks. It's in the contract. No! Pink! Pink everywhere! And not a slot bag in sight! covered the insurance in case anything went wrong which means it's holiday time this is a dog nonsense this is perfect where's the tv no tv here thank goodness where's the pool no pool we'll swim in the lake where are the toilets no toilets only joking. <laughs> it's over there. That's the toilet. This is real camping. Oh. 
yes, Dot. The bonjour trees. Bonjour, birds. Bonjour. Oh. Bonjour. Oh, um, uh, bonjour, monsieur. Ah, anglais. Um, I, I think that means welcome. Hand me that pole, please, Henry. Comfy beds and hot showers? That's not real camping. Bonjour, camping! We're staying here, Henry, so you might as well stop making a fuss and enjoy yourself. <laughs> Can it get any worse? Last one in's a cowardly custard! <laughs> Come on, you two! It's lovely! <laughs> Much better than a swimming pool, eh, Peter? Much better. Go, go, go on, Henry! No way! It's filthy! And the snakes will get me! Snakes! Don't be such a baby! You're coming in! No! Come on! A bit of mud never hurt anyone! No! Oh! I... I... Hey, nature! What's that? I don't know. Probably a werewolf. No, it's not. You're just trying to scare me. Oh! Th th that was you, Henry. No, it wasn't. See? It wasn't me. I think it was an owl. Or a werewolf pretending to be an owl. Werewolves are very clever. Well, good night then. Oh, Henry, I need the toilet. Go then. It's dark out there. What if I meet, you know, the werewolf? Go ahead. I'll keep guard with the torch. Werewolves don't like light. <laughs> now he's safe from the werewolf. Oh, it's really dark in here. <laughs> and smelly. <laughs> Henry? Henry! Peter. Peter? Um, asleep? Oh, Henry took my torch and left me in the toilet. Henry! I know! I'm horrid! Send me home, please! Oh, no you don't. Your father wants to be close to nature and that's what we're doing. Why couldn't we camp in our back garden? That's close to nature and proper toilets too. Nonsense! This is our holiday. Come on, Peter. I thought holidays were supposed to be fun for everybody. Nature! <laughs> you Rico, That's it! They want to be close to nature? Then they're gonna be close to nature! Stupid, stupid sheep. St 
stupid. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! What is it, Peter? What's the matter? There's nothing there. Bonnie, you are very scary. I'm bored. I'm not. Can we go for a walk? What a good idea, Peter. But it's pouring with rain. Nonsense. Just a spot of drizzle. Oh, I love walking in the rain. <laughs> I'm not going. Fine. You stay here and collect wood for the fire. Me? Where am I supposed to find wood? In the wood. Where else? And make sure it's dry. and I'll show you where you're bunking. Follow me. Not me. I'm going home. <laughs> oh, three whole days without Henry. Bliss. I don't know. My parents send me here every summer. So what's it like? Oh, it's just like the army. Fall in, fall out, quick march, about turn. <laughs> don't worry, though. They tell you what to do. Oh, I love being told what to do. No one tells me what to do. Stand by your beds. Bedtime, lights out. No talking. But it's only six o'clock. You need your sleep, young man. Tomorrow will be a big day. No reading after lights out. Can't <laughs> stop me. Whoa! Everyone, stand by your beds. Stra 
Take that pillow, turn down that cover. And you can get rid of that. Henry, sir. Is this your bed, Henry? Yes, uh, sir. It's a disgrace. Fifty press-ups. Now. One, two. We're off to the assault course. Mm, what's an assault course? I don't know. Whatever it is, oh, I'm not doing it. Juniors, this way. Well, that doesn't look too bad. Seniors, this way. Go, 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 go! <laughs> Henry, what are you waiting for? Christmas! Kilometer run tomorrow. Oh, you want to escape, don't you? Uh, I don't know. Shh. You start digging, and I'll keep watch. I don't know. I don't know. Well, we can't just sit here. Let's go before they come back. Uh, which way is home? Uh, I don't know. We're lost. What if we can't get out of here? What if they never find us? What if we get eaten by wolves? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Pizza or chips? I don't know. Burger. Pizza or chips or burger? If you had to choose. Um. Yes? I don't know. <laughs> Wait. They came this way. How do you know? Tracks. Oh, you 
worm, Mr. Kale! If it wasn't for your brother's tracking skills, we might not have found you. Shall we wake your friend? I don't know. And so we come to my favourite part of the summer, the Camp Sunshine Awards. And the Hunter, Tracker and Sculptor Award goes to Peter. Congratulations, Peter. Oh, goody! I've got a badge! Well done, Peter. Next is our Survival Skills Award. And this year, one recruit stood out from all the rest. Henry. Well done, Henry. And every year, our two top recruits share a prize of a free week's holiday. Camp Sunshine. Well, you know what I'm going to say to that, don't you? No! <laughs> <laughs>